Edna Pontellier's journey in the Awakening can be broken up into three sections based on location. Grand Isle, New Orleans, Grand Isle. We'll trace the events of Edna's Awakening right after this. When the book opens, it's the late 1800s and Edna is vacationing with her family at a holiday resort by the sea. Four important events occur during her summer stay at Grand Isle. Edna spends time with her friend Adele, whose openness awakens Edna emotionally. Edna spends time with Robert Lebrun, who awakens her to love. Edna hears Mademoiselle Rice play the piano and awakens to the language of art. Edna learns to swim and awakens to the idea of freedom. When the summer ends, Edna and her family head back to New Orleans, where Edna moves into the next stage of her awakening, acting on her newly discovered freedom. Four more important events occur there. Edna breaks from social convention and stops acting the way her husband wants her to. She goes walking and visits with friends instead of taking callers and attending to her children. Edna dedicates herself to painting. Edna begins an affair with the town flirt, I'll say. Edna moves into her own home and tries to convince Robert that they can be together. When Robert proves unable to break free the way Edna has, Edna heads back to Grand Isle where she swims out to sea and drowns.